this morning on Secrets to Living Longer, Superfoods for a Healthy and Longer Life. Our registered dietitian, Carrie Glassman, is here now to tell us what to eat to maximize our health. Good morning. Good morning. Lots to cover here, so let's get right to it. Let's start with yogurt. Yogurt, most people think of yogurt for calcium and bone health. One of my favorite reasons to eat yogurt and kefir, they're both fermented milk products, so they have live bacteria that helps your immunity. Uh -huh. They really keep your gut intact. Think about them as like a natural defense system. Yeah, I always, when your tummy hurts, best thing ever. Exactly. Apple a day? Absolutely. Keeps it's cliche, that, but it works. It does. It absolutely keeps that doctor away. The soluble and insoluble fiber helps keep you regular as well as, well as lowers your cholesterol. And the skin of the apple, very high in a compound that has been shown to reduce the incidence of heart attacks. Love those apples. One a day. Uh, avocados, I'm thrilled to hear that we should be eating. Avocados. Does guacamole are, count? Guacamole does count. One, one of my favorite heart healthy fats, and I still have to give a shout out to all the nuts over there as well. But the other reason I love avocados is because of a compound called the lutein. Lutein is very important for eye health. So it's not just about the carrots. Think about avocados for eye health and as well. And don't worry about the fat. It's good fat. It's good fat, but of course you still need to do it in moderation. Okay. Um, now this is a little strange, but I do love it. Seaweed. Seaweed is excellent. It is more abundant in minerals than almost any other food out there. So no saying ew at home right now. Give it a try. Calcium. It's high in calcium, so it's great for bone health. It's also high in folate, which is excellent for heart health and also good for prenatal women. And, and it doesn't have to taste fishy. You can you can mix it. Not in at all. Ways. Absolutely. Sprinkle it on a salad. Wrap up some turkey in it. But buy organic because we know that items from the sea do hold on to certain toxins. Yes. So try to go for organic. Splurge there. We know that blueberries are the brain food, right? The Blue best ever. Blueberries are brain food in my house. It's a cup of blueberries before your multivitamin. So important. They are the most powerful antioxidant. Heart health. So important. And again, like you said, important for curbing your brain aging. I hope everybody's writing all this down. This is like <laughs> speed round of healthy foods. Exactly. All you right. can go to this website and check it all out I after know. too. What's what else is going on with the juices? I love the goji. It's hard to find. Goji's hard to find. It's new here and it's found in juice form. It's from China. Very high in the carotenoids, which you find in carrots, which we know are important for preventing heart disease and cancer. Okay. There new research on it. And then we have pomegranate juice, which is excellent, really high in certain compounds that are higher than any other juice out there. Good for heart health as well as blood pressure. And some of these are a little bit expensive, but you don't need to chug them. You you mm. know, a little a bit goes a long way. A little bit goes a long way. You're exactly right. And then green tea, we know, of course, is so important, like blueberries, powerful for everything from preventing osteoporosis to heart health to preventing cancer. All right. I know we want to talk about supplements. Let's do that on the website really quick, really quick. Your top five foods. Bring them, girl. One cup of blueberries, one cup of non-fat yogurt, one cup of green tea, a half an ounce of walnuts or a quarter of an avocado, as well as two ounces of pomegranate juice, and you are good to go for the day. Get it all in at breakfast. That's right. And, and no burgers from yeah, McDonald's. Exactly. And stay away from all the bad stuff, too. <laughs> all right. Thank you, Craig Glassman. As always, we appreciate it. And for more on superfoods, just go to our website at earlyshow.cbsnews.com.